हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल साइंस विद श्वेता द टॉपिक ऑफ दिस वीडियो इज साइंस ऑफ क्लास वन द फर्स्ट चैप्टर इज लिविंग एंड नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स दिस लेसन विल हेल्प यू टू स्टडी अबाउट लिविंग एंड नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स हैव यू नोटिस द डिफरेंट थिंग्स अराउंड यू फॉर एग्जाम्पल टेबल चेयर्स टॉयज प्लांट्स बर्ड्स एट्सेट्रा Some of these things can grow in size but some cannot for example plants can grow but toys can't they have the same size throughout the life this is because plants are living and toys are non living things let's discuss more about living and non living things the organisms which possesses life and have the ability to eat grow respire reproduce obtain and use energy is called living things they are capable of responding to stimulus and evolve and adapt to their environment but non living things are the one which has stopped displaying the characteristics of life thus they lack or no longer displaying the capability for growth reproduction respiration and movement they also are not capable of responding to stimulus or evolve and adapt to their environment living and non living things are different from many ways first one is food and water all living things need food and water to carry out all the activities plants make their own food in the presence of water sunlight and soil animals and human beings depend on plants for food non living things do not need food for their survival next characteristic is growth all living things follow a life cycle in which they are born grow and finally die a seed grows into a seedling then into a plant and finally into a tree a baby grows into an adult and finally becomes old Animals also grow from babies to adults as the living beings grow they change in size shape and appearance non living things do not grow and they remain the same next characteristic of living things is movement all living things move from one place to another animals move in search of food some animals hunt for their food while others graze on grass birds fly in the air fish swim in the water human beings roam from different activities plants though living do not move from place to another place we need to push or pull to move a non living things non living things cannot move on their own next characteristic is breathe all living things also need to breathe and stay alive All living things have an organ which help in breathing. Non-living things do not have life, they do not breathe. Next characteristic is reproduction. All living things produce more of its kind by the process of reproduction. Some animals lay eggs while others including human beings give birth to young ones. Seeds produce plants. Non-living things do not reproduce. Next characteristic is response. Living things have sense organs like eyes, nose, tongue, skin and ears due to which they respond to changes in their environment. Non-living things do not feel they are not affected by any changes around them. Now we are able to distinguish between living and non-living things. These are the characteristic features of living and non-living things. In next video I will discuss next chapter of science class 1 If you like my video please subscribe my channel and press bell icon for notification Thank you for watching my video